Good morning. I'm in McDonald's line. My husband just called me. Called me and said thank you. I said thank me for what? For helping me. I said oh baby. Yeah you know I'm going to help you. He said yeah thank you for helping me. And anyway. Yeah. I tell you the truth. I was just thinking about him before he called. Have a great day at school. Okay. They texting in the group. Kids going back to school today. I didn't know that. I thought they were going to be out in town for Christmas. I guess they need to take their little butts back. But anyway, um, yeah, he thinking about me, honey. He lay up there and he have a lot, a whole lot of time to think. Whole, whole lot of time to think. Yeah, he just took his medicine, so he good and high too. So, so if he's saying it why he high, he really mean it. <laughs> He thanking me while he had, he really thankful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. He's not talking crazy. He thanking his wife this morning. All right. Y'all have a good day. I'll be praying for y'all too, as I do. I pray for all of y'all. Bye-bye. Today was take your man to work day. And then we had our doctor's appointment at his doctor's appointment. What? Take your man to work day. I took care of Auntie. We made it here on time. Got here 10 minutes early, actually. We got here 10 minutes early. I'm in McDonald's line on Summer Avenue. Oh, yeah. God is good. It's a gloomy-like day, but it's beautiful. I was thinking about my little husband and I was saying, when real adversity come, that's when you find out the real measure of a man. I married a man. You hear me? I already knew that before he fell off the ladder, but everything we're going through is just like confirmation. Confirmation from God. Yes. Let me order. I'll talk to y'all later. I'm still in the thrift store. Look, my t-shirt says, no photos, please. <laughs> I'm like one of the movie stars. I really don't want to be bothered today. No makeup. I slept late. Enjoyed sleeping late. And no makeup. Uh-huh. You know. I put a cookbook that's got a green tag on it, which means it's half price. I really don't need cookbooks, but I like looking through them, getting ideas. I put my spin on that taco, that taco soup recipe that my sister gave me. So, she went to Searcy, Arkansas and talked some of her co-workers in Searcy out of this recipe. They made taco soup while she was there. And uh, she gave me some and it was delicious. Now, my husband said it was a little too spicy for him. So I made my spin on it. I added a few other seasonings. And uh, I think it's going to be delicious. I tasted it last night. He ate just a little bit last night too. So we'll probably eat something different today. And we will uh, start on it tomorrow. It's supposed to turn cold tomorrow. So we'll eat taco soup for a couple of days. And uh, things like that. I'm going to share the recipe with y'all, the taco soup. I took a picture of the ingredients when I had them lined up after I fixed it. So when I um, take the pot out and warm it up, I'll show y'all the soup and uh, then show you the ingredients and tell you how I made it. They had a lot of racks they putting out, so I came in here at a good time. All right, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this. We'll live around here somewhere, but I'm getting ready to enjoy it myself as long as I can. Because in a minute, he gonna want to, um, he gonna want to go get something to eat. That's a beautiful dress. Uh -huh. Willie is calling my name. I have learned a tremendous amount about myself. I'm coming. I'm a better person than I ever thought I was. A lot better. 
become stronger. Kisses. I'm loving and caring. Thank you. I'm God's child and I'm very special. I asked you that you want salad. Okay, I'll just fix your plate. Yeah. Okay. All right. We eat how in the hall. <laughs> Our buffet. Our buffet how in the hall. We eat in Brick House. It's a buffet style restaurant. We just left the doctor's office. David Cooper, he's good. My husband's been feeling good. I got the bare bones on today. Looking like Halloween. Looking like Halloween. My spider earrings on. Uh huh, the Goodwill. I got it from the Goodwill. Carry my school purse. That came from TJ Maxx years ago in Nashville. TJ Maxx in Nashville. As a matter of fact, it was my last girl's trip. Uh-huh. Just before November the 10th, we went to Nashville the weekend before. And I bought that bag. We just thought about it. Well, I'm drinking zero. I mainly have salad and spinach. Yeah, I'm trying to wash my blood sugar. It's zero, yeah. They got zero here. I should have gave you zero. I'm sorry. I go get this on. I gave him some sweet tea because he's not a diabetic. I am. But since we drink zero at home, he's used to zero now. This is my plate. Good. Later. Oh, okay. She told me to. I Yeah. <laughs>